Welcome back to Potionomics with Gun Bunny, G U N and Bunny. And I know that we left off and it looked dire, but thank you so much for sticking with me. Trust me, I got this. I know what I'm doing. <laughs> it's scary, but I do. Onward! Now it's all just time. That's that dirty sneak. What are we talking about? Roxanne! She keeps throwing curveballs at me. Perhaps, although whether or not wicked intentions are afoot, the local economy is turbulent. If we have any hope of surviving, we must nimble, versatile, unfailingly vigilant. It'd be easier if I had room for more cauldrons. Imagine if I could brew more than one type of potion at a time. Of course, if I were making more potions, I'd also want more shelving space. You're right. Carpentry could be a worthwhile investment, so as long as you don't blow through your meager profits. Gotta spend it to make it. Hey, that is the title of this game. Only where do I spend it? Do you know any carpenters? I heard of one. A witch with great skill who lives on the very edge of the forest. Saffron is her name. Alright, fly out there and introduce myself. You know, I'm... Alright, I'll fly out there and introduce myself. You know, in all my ample free time. And yet, you still find time to complain at me. I got this. Roxanne's making trouble. Escapism. As the escape room craze takes Rafta by storm, so does the desire for mental boosting mana potions. Increase her mana potions. Pounding sand. Rafta has begun importing desert sand to expand its beaches. Making the Bone Waste region a little less treacherous for now. Okay. Interesting. Alright, let's check our brew. We've got a fresh day started. Everything's lined up. Bottle this giant fire tonic. Very pleased. Except, there, that's challenge worthy, this bad boy. Okay, I'll come back to this in just two seconds. Hang on! Hang on, two seconds. Custom order. I hate to turn him in. Alright, and... Do I have any custom orders going right now? I do not. Brew? Really need a very, very solid health potion. We have our fire potion. We're good. Recipe. The health potion is just red and green, right? Okay, let's turn the yellow off. Green. Mmm. Guess we're just doing big red and big green. Okay. It's yellow. Green. Thank you. Do I have the very big green? Mmm. Fungus is very big green. Okay, I don't hate that. Too. Oh, and it's got blue in it. Oops, I can't read. Oops, it's this one. I only have one of those. Mm. Just not big enough. Maybe I wait, get more manworm root today. What's the mana potion take? Okay, I've got an eighteen green. Still not high enough. Be better if I just go that way. Hmm. What is the better road? 
probably just to make a very solid health potion. And just make a fire potion and sell it. You know, like... I don't have whatever this fungus makes. Oh, green blue gets me. I'm gonna have to wait and get that recipe. Got all that weight. This is one of the number. I am 30 points off this path. This is the random element. Do not like this. There's too much random problems. Alright. Let's just get something in. To go shop anyway. There's Saffron. Alright. I suppose I should see her first because I don't know what I want to build. Ooh, it's nice out here. Sorry about that. I was just securing the timber. I need to put the finishing touches on a new galleon. You're building a whole galleon from scratch? Well, nothing is made from nothing. The forest provides everything I need for my projects. And every carpenter should be able to fleet every now and then. Keeps you sharp. My name's Saffron, by the way. Would you like to hear more about my services? That's why I'm here. I'm Sylvia. I run a potion shops in town. Hello, Sylvia. You're the most welcome here. As if potions are... And if potions are your business, then sooner or later you'll need fuel for your cauldron's fire. I can supply whatever you need from the magical infused hardwood of this enchanted forest to more exotic fare. Sounds amazing. Hold on now. That's only half of it. Uh, I'm also a fully licensed carpenter of no small skill. Looking to make the most of your limited space? I'll fix her up in no time. Now, what I miss? Is there anything else you're looking for? Maybe some advice. I'm so pretty new to running a business. And I've been at it a long time. Really? How old are you? Ha! Well, there's your advice, I suppose. Never ask a witch her age. No shame in getting older. Well, it's better than the alternative. It's hard to argue with that, even if the years can feel like a burden at times. Let's just say I've been around long enough to see some real sights. If that's true, then you must have some good advice to share. You're cute, Sylvia. I think I like you. You're cute, too. I like your hat. <laughs> I also like my hat. Keeps the sun out of my eyes. So maybe I do have some odd bits of wisdom to share. First, get a hat. Second, I can see that you're stressed. You carry tension in your shoulders. But you mustn't let the trials of your life, whether customers or debt, family drama rule you. Instead, practice a bit of mental self-care at the form of meditation. Your business will only thrive when you thrive. Meditate. Decrease stress by two. So how'd I do? I could definitely use that. Thanks. Why don't you make a point to come back soon? I'll see what else I can come up with. I haven't had many visitors recently. A visitor who comes seeking wisdom is welcome indeed. All right, gift looking up. What do? I do? Oh, it's eat. All right, nice. All right, well we'll start with this one. Perfect. All right, carpentry first. Uh, additional shelf available. Additional cauldron available. I don't have any of these things, and I know it's because I got to go all the way in the mushroom mire and the, the desert. Darn it. Alright, fuel. At least we can do some of this. See what I mean by it's amazing how fast you start to have problems? Alright, Baptiste first. There are so many things that take time. And so many things you have to, to, to go for. What did we get? 
and a, a bonus slime we already have. So, invest. Ooh, stuff I don't have. Thank you. Upsetting the environment. Alright. We really need to do these to the... All the way. I just don't think I have enough. But I'm just gonna look. Yeah, I need a mana potion and a health potion and a fire potion to get all the way through. Which is what I kinda figured. Alright, embark! We might as well go. We won't get much, but we might as well go. Alright, Saffron Baptiste, I've sent Mitt off. It's Quinn time! Alright, Quinn. Expand your mind! Whoops, I didn't give Mint a thing. Hang on, Baptiste, two seconds. It doesn't hurt me to move around. It's it's no points, so it's fine. It's fine. Eeft. Oh, did I not buy anymore? Okay, Gwyn, Gwyn first. Ah! All right, chop. Still very expensive. Just one. What does Saffron like as a present? Because I should do that real quick. Alright, it was plant and I gave her one. See? I'm mental. I take a two second bathroom break and suddenly. But I still don't think I have a fish. Let's look. Nope. Doesn't want me to get to know Muktuk at all. Alright, expensive gifts. Just saying. Alright, shop. I need to do a very good health potion. Red and green. Alright, let's get it. I have a bigger green? I don't think I do, but let's just have a boop. I think it's gonna have to me That fills a cauldron. Things are expensive because I'm destroying the ecosystem. Trust me, I, re I really am. I, I, <laughs> I am well aware that I am wrecking the environment right now. It's not good. I'm not proud of it, but it doesn't mean I'm not doing it. All right. Broke. Gift. All right, and I can rank him up. Who else can I rank up? Them. Excuse me. I tend to say him. I, I can't entirely explain why. Because it is better to rank up one person as we move around. So let's do Saffron. I'm making slow but steady progress on a jigsaw puzzle. Would you care to pitch in? Saffron has laid out the pieces of a jigsaw puzzle on top of a tree stump. She already has the border of the puzzle completed. Based on the frame alone, Sylvia can t uh, can't tell what image the puzzle will make. Is it just me, or does every piece look the same? I hate puzzles. I mean, in real life, I hate puzzles. I, I, I do not find them pleasurable, even when I can do them. 
Well, it's an image foliage, so the entire puzzle is green. But green contains multitudes. Look closer. You'll see fern green, sage, juniper, moss. Success will, cry... Success will require us to be mindful of the subtle variations. Pass. Oh, pass. Sylvia thinks she spots a match. She takes up a piece. She describe it as booger green. It doesn't fit. Maybe it does. Almost. She pushes harder. Maybe it's a slight manufacturing flaw. She slams a piece repeatedly with her gloved fist. Ha! Got it! Yes, that's quite a technique you have, but maybe I should get you a hammer. I don't want to make too much noise. It's so quiet out here, so calm. But it must get lonely sometimes. I wouldn't say that. In fact, I very much enjoy the peace and quiet. And I keep busy. For instance, I spent most of the morning putting a bridge together. Made a whole bridge this morning? Well, sure. Lately, Hero's Guild has sealed all sorts of greenhorns out into the forest. A well-placed footbridge endures they stay on the path, which is safer for them, and safer for the forest, too. But I don't mean it as a jab when I say I, I enjoy the quiet. I like solitude, but I like your company, too. Feelings mutual. I'm not just here for the kindling, you know. That's right. After all, what good is kindling without a spark, hmm? But I'm curious about something. You asked me if I get lonely out here. Let me turn your question around on you. Doesn't the hustle and bustle of the town ever wear you down? No, I thrive on it. The energy, the noise, it makes me feel alive. That's me in real life. I, I, I like quiet activities and cottage core, but I love the buzz. Well, you're, we're very different people. In that, I respect. And it's worth keeping in mind that some of your customers are probably feeling overwhelmed by all the stimulation. With a soothing voice and a calm demeanor, you can make your shop in the island of tranquility and the raging sea alive. Help guide their thoughts through the storm, and I'll bet you you'll see results. Guided thought. I could be a perfect picture of plasticness. Watch me. I believe it. In fact, I believe you can do anything you set your mind to. Now, have you seen a pine green piece with three Audis in the socket? It's gonna be here. It's gotta be here somewhere. All right. Now we go home. Check out our brew. Two more. Alright. I don't think I have anything to run the shop with. I can sell the one I've got that I need to keep. Not good. I'm going to waste some time traveling. This is not good. Let's go see Muktuk. If I can give him anything else. Like, I don't have any fish. Which I know is what he likes. But I mean, like, can I just technically give him something else and just sort of... You know? It's a mineral. It's a something. It's a gift. <laughs> Craft. I don't think I can do anything. Broke is a joke. And this, this is why you saw me buy wood. So we don't do this anymore. Let's rank up Quinn. By the way, I'm not going to tell you guys who I'm going to romance. You just get to guess. So ride the ride. Check it out. I got my hands on some squid vine. The hero I bought it off of said she would re uh, relied on your potions while she was out on the reef. I was skeptical, but it seems our little ecosystem is developing nicely. I got you something, seeing as how you're pulling your weight and all. That would decrease the cost of ingredients. Good. 
this is great. Thanks. Whoa. You sure get excited easy. Before you get too excited, I have to break it to you that this squid vine isn't for sale. I'm curious what sort of vision it might give me. So I'm taking it out of my uh, out of uh, circulation. Stick around and watch if you want. Hope you know what you're doing. What fun would that be? Quinn slurps down the vine as if it were a strand of spaghetti. It can take a few minutes sometimes. I gotta sort of let my mind go blank. Just track my surroundings a little. Careful, it's a long way down. Only really makes it more of a rush. Wait, whoa, there it is. What do you see? You don't see it? It's so clear. There's a woman tending to her garden. Her hair is bloating. Can't make out her face. The light is weird. All refracted like a prism. Do I know her? Is she... No. Never mind. For a second, I thought I recognized her. What else did you see? Anything good? Nothing worth seeing. Ugh, this is a waste of time. What were you hoping to see? Something in particular? Butts, Sylvia. I was hoping to see some butts. It's too bad I can't exert any kind of control over these visions. That's not on you. I appreciate you sticking around. You need to get back to work, though. I'll bet you do, too. Yeah, there's bound to be some kind of calamity at the shop before long. Hey, don't do me psychotic to figure that one out. Don't need to be psychic. See, I just fill these things in. You don't need to be psychotic to figure that out either. Try this again. Home. Ugh, what a mess. Tiny little error. Big mistake. That's all right. We've got our health potion now. That's good. And something to sell. So let's just get this fixed up. Still not that much. Terrible. Just doesn't have the juice. It's alright. Doesn't change the fact we gotta do the mana potion. So, let's get some yellow. A basic green for six. All right, three brew points. That'll get me through till tomorrow and start me fresh, which is what we need. Arrange potions. Deck builder. All right, we're at the part of the story where we completely rebuild the deck. There we go. All right. Two close it outs. And then I think I have better cards than pretty much everything here. Two scheme. Two shock factor and one press the attack. Two pump it up, two enthusiasm. One guided thought. One captivate. 
and two build rapport. One, keep your guard up. Okay, let's do a plant the seed and the second press the attack. And two, set them up. There we go. Happy with it. Custom orders, I don't have any. Brew is working. Making sure that's right before I open shop. Open shop! Open shop! Shock factor. Enthusiasm. Scheme for two. Guide thought. Close it out. Not terrible. Not spectacular. Uh, fire tonic. Three days. Yep. Build rapport. Raise interest by eight. Opener. Apply sympathy for two turns. In Enthusiasm for 20. That's the sympathy working for me. And scheme for two. Uh, pump it up, set them up, and close it out. Yeah. There we go. That's how that's done. Very nice. Good. Little money until tomorrow. She's not a bad potion maker, but the snoring. All right, I'm going to call that episode there. Yeah, it's a short one. Sorry. But look, we're coming around. We will try to make the next one longer. Thank you so much for joining me. This has been Gun Bunny, G-U-N-N, Bunny. And I hope you guys have a great day. Goodbye.